Anyway, yeah, you can get some of these files from the Wayback Machine. Um, Compact.com. This one's from 1999. Anyway, yeah, here's the BIOS you don't want. 732 Revision A. It supersedes SP5992, which is the one that does not have the delay. So, get this one. Um, yeah, that's a better BIOS. Um, a guy called Vintage Compact Enthusiast um, directed me here. Um, I totally forgot to use this site. but And then there's another site, uh, greyghost.com mooo.com and he's got a bunch of information on the uh, compact 5000 including the uh, bios bug um, so he actually knows there's a major post issue I noticed it right away and I went looking around and then uh, sure enough this guy has some good information software but uh, some good resources for this laptop Okay, so we got a little Compact 5000 update. Um, there's a super long delay whenever I boot. Um, so, I downloaded um, a different BIOS file. It's actually EXE called SP5992 or something. I copied that to the hard drive ran the program, then it formatted a diskette. So that's what I'm doing now. Um, so I'm going to downgrade the firmware. Because apparently, the newest firmware has some kind of bug where the post just takes forever. So let's see how this goes. Alright, so the newer one I have is 53198, which sucks. So I'm going to go with the 102297. I also have a problem with the floppy drive. Um, a lot of times it doesn't want to work, so I have to take it out of the case play with it a little bit uh, and then reinstall it in the laptop and then all of a sudden it starts working again so it's kind of flaky an image of your current ROM has been successfully read by the compact ROM pack utility if you have I get it if you have enough free space on your diskette that a backup of the system ROM has been created don't need it If you continue, your firmware will be reprogrammed. Once the reprogramming of the ROM has begun, it cannot be interrupted. This process will only take a few seconds. Alright. So we're going back in time here. Programming firmware. Do not reboot or power cycle your machine. The system ROM has been successfully reprogrammed. Please remove the ROM pack diskette and power cycle your system. Get the diskette out. Enter. Did we break it? Come on. Did it just shut off? I guess so. <laughs> yeah. Way quicker. That would have taken probably three minutes. Alright, so don't get the latest BIOS, it sucks. 
there we go.